Here's your dinner, Miss Applewood. Susan, what is this? It's your pureed meal. No, no, get me chicken nuggets. You can't have chicken nuggets. You can't chew them. This looks like what was in my diaper this morning, Susan. And this? It's puree tofu. It's doo-doo. I want chicken nuggets. No. Susan, I want chicken nuggets. You're not getting chicken nuggets. Thank you for the roses. Thank you for the roses. Mmm, <coughs> ice cream. Miss Applewood, we have a new resident on our floor. Susan, I am working. You're 103 years old. You don't work anymore, Miss Applewood. I really want you to meet this new resident. You'll really like him. I don't want to meet him. Tell him to leave. He lives here. He can't leave. I really think you should try making friends, Miss Applewood. Fine! Hi, I'm Mr. Stevens. Hi, I'm Miss Apple. What? Susan, I'm in love. You have a husband. Mama, I'm in love. What is she doing? This is how she flirts. Miss Applewood, I left you some markers and some paper so you can color. I have to go get some work done, so just call me if you need any help, okay? Okay, thank you, Susan. I will. Help! Help me! Help! Miss Applewood, what happened? Susan, I was lonely. Look, everyone, this poor old lady is eating lunch all by herself. Are you recording me, Jennifer? Old age is so beautiful. Who are you calling? Good morning. Good morning. It's time to take your medicine. Bombastic side eye. No, Miss Applewood. There'll be no side eyeing today. Now take your medicine. <sighs> you really thought you ate that? No, I don't. But you need to eat your medicine. No, I don't want my medication. I want girl dinner. After you take your medicine. Girl dinner. No, please don't start singing again. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. All right, unplug your life support. Miss Applewood, you soiled yourself. Come on, let's go and get you cleaned up. No, I'm in my pooping my pants era. What happened to your clean girl era? Let's bring that back. Clean girl aesthetic. Exactly. Now let's go get washed up. You're giving me the ick. You're giving me the ick because you smell so bad. Where'd you get that? What are you eating? My husband. Today we will be making our last girl dinner. Miss Applewood, are you on your phone again? Your grandchildren don't want you to have too much screen time. Mind your business, Susan! What is our dessert? Moldy muffins. Yes, that's my favorite food. I need my glasses. Cake? No, no, no. Too sweet, too sweet. Need some mold on it. Pizza? No, no. Too cheese. Too much cheese! No! Yes. Yes. Toenail clippings. What's my drink? Wash it all down with the 7-Up. Good. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. How much? Delectable. Red olives. All right. No, 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 no. I'm not taking my vitamins. Miss Applewood, you need to take your vitamins. No, I told you I'm not taking my vitamins, Susan. <sighs> See, this is why I told you to stop yelling so much. I don't yell. Anyways, scrumdily umptious. Miss Applewood, your grandchildren are here to see you. Tell them to go home. I'm busy. You're not busy. I'm trying to see what kind of dog I am. Ah! Today I will be seeing who has a crush on me. Six, five. <laughs> I would climb that like a tree. Miss Applewood, what did you just say? No one's talking to you, Susan. Bartender, I don't know because I'm a material girl. He doesn't make that much money. Cancer, oh, he's a 10 out of 10 in looks. <laughs> no one would ever have a crush on you, Miss Applewood, because you're not a very nice lady. That's not true, Susan. I have a husband. Now, what is this filter? I'm a fan. Hmm. Ah! Susan! Susan! Why are you spinning? I don't know, but make it stop! Mrs. Applewood lived a long life, but unfortunately, one dreadful day she turned into a fan, and she couldn't stop spinning. Not even Susan could he pee her. Give me now! Bombastic side eye. Girl dinner. 
girl than our sleigh. It's worse than I thought, Doctor. Her dementia's progressing fast. All she can remember is internet sayings from back in her day. My name is Jeff. It's not looking good, Susan. Let me ask her some basic questions. What's 9 plus 10? 21. This isn't good. She doesn't even know basic math. Miss Applewood, do you remember me? What's my name? Who am I? You're a pain in my ass. I'm about like the Barbie. Susan, play Barbie World. Nurse Susan's not on this floor anymore. Who are you? I'm Nurse Jennifer. I'll be taking care of you from now on. No, 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 no. Get Susan. Get Susan. I don't want you. I want Susan. Susan doesn't want to see you. Now take your heart medicine and vitamins. I don't take my medicine. And Susan knows that. And she knows I don't take my vitamins. I want Susan here. If you were nice to Susan, she wouldn't have requested to change floors. <sighs> Whatever. I'll go get her myself. Miss Applewood, no. Hey, stop running. Dirty dad. Oh, the enjoyment. Miss Applewood, it's time to take your heart medicine. Susan, you came back for me. I had no choice, Miss Applewood. Nurse Jennifer quit because you hit her with a tray. Good times. That wasn't very nice. Now take your heart medicine. No, 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 no. I don't take my heart medicine, and you know that. If you don't take it, you could have a heart attack. I don't have heart attacks. <gasps> oh, no. <gasps> Miss Applewood. <laughs> That's not funny. That's not something you should joke about, Miss Applewood. <sighs> <gasps> not again. Susan! Susan! I'm not falling for it. If you want mine, I give this... Miss Applewood! Ah! The other residents are trying to sleep. Susan, I was performing! I told you, no performances after 8 p.m. You should be resting anyways. You just had a heart attack. I don't have heart attacks, Susan! I told you! Did you unplug your oxygen? You need it. Your oxygen levels are so low. I don't need oxygen, Susan. Not when you're around. Treat me like YG, don't get me dirty That's it, I'm resigning <gasps> I can't breathe, I can't breathe, Susan! Mommy, did you want us any food today? No, I lost again, darling, I'll have to try again tomorrow But Mommy, I'm starving, we haven't eaten in days What about Sissy, did she play? I did, but I lost Unfortunately, we can only play once a day I can play No, you can't, you're too young I'm old enough, I can play in the Hungry Games let her try and win some food. I'll come with her. Okay, you can go. I know you're very hungry. You can try and win us all some food, but be careful. People are very hostile when they're hungry. I'm here to play a game for food. Welcome. You'll be playing against Miss Turner. Listen here, little brat. I got family to feed. I'm not losing. Miss Turner, you better watch yourself. The game you will be playing is rock, paper, scissors. Begin. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors. scissors. I chose paper. Scissors beats paper. Here's your food. Congratulations. Thank you. You guys, I got 10 bits to feed. You guys, I got 10 bits to feed. Miss Turner, that is not your food to touch. <laughs> sissy, close your eyes. Here, give me the food. I'll hold it for you. You sissy. Don't touch food that doesn't belong to you. <gasps> Why would you do that? That was my sister. I'm here to play a game for food. Your opponent is Derek. The game is Simon Says. Simon Says, touch your head. Derek, be quiet, I can't hear him. Touch your... Derek! No, 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 no. He didn't say Simon Says. Derek is the winner. Yes! You cheated, Derek. Now I can't eat today. Did you win your game today? I lost. They made a new rule that you can play for food more than once a day. But if you lose your second try, you die. Please promise me you won't play more than once a day. Yeah, Mom. I promise. Brianna? Timmy? Did you win any food today? I lost. I lost my game, too. How about you and I play again and face each other in the Hungry Games? I'm in. Harry had a little lamb. Emily, little stop singing. Where did you learn to sing? I don't know. I just heard it on the TV. You only sing when you want to kill someone. They play that on the TV because they want you to sing, but you can't, okay? Okay. Honey, are you off to school now? Yeah, I am. You forgot to wear your earplugs. You must always keep them on while you're in public. Do I have to wear them? It's for your protection. You never know when someone could start singing. Hey, girl. Hey. Ouch. Now I got your attention. What? Keep out those earplugs. I want to talk to you. My mom makes me wear them. She says you never know when someone could start singing. Come on, hand them over. We're at school. No one would start singing here. Bring around the rosies, a pocket full of- Help! Bring around the rosies, a pocket full of- Help! Rosies, ashes, 
Here's your earplugs back. I was wrong. You might actually need them. I saw someone die. Was it just him or were there others? There were three others who didn't cover their ears in time. Hey, they canceled school for the day. Go home and get some rest. Mom, I'm home. Mary had a little lamb. Emily, little stop lamb. singing. Little lamb. Emily, Mary why are you singing? I told you not to. It kills people. Lamb, its fleece was white as Mom! Mom, there's something wrong with Emily. She won't stop singing. She's going to kill someone. Mary had a little lamb. Why are you singing? Little lamb. I need to get out of here. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Rock. Goodbye, babe. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Rock. Goodbye, baby. Why is everyone singing? Attention all citizens. Singing has now become contagious. You must wear earplugs at all times to stop the spread. Mary had a little lamb. Rock a bye baby on the treetops. Ashes, ashes. Everyone's singing. Hey, take out your earplugs. What? It's just me and you. It's just us? Yes. Okay. Ring around the rosies. It's time to face your fear. <gasps> Fuck this. Ah! I think I'm safe from the broccolis. Ah! 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 Oh no, sweetie. Did you get chosen to face your fear? I did. You have to take a bite of the broccoli. No, it's scary. If you don't face your fear and take a bite of the broccoli, you'll die. Why did I just get a timer? That's how much time left you have to face your fear. Come on, sweetie, eat the broccoli! Mm. No reaction. It's time to face your fear. Mm. Are you serious right now? It's time to face your fear. Are you serious right now? Whoa, whoa, where am I going? Ah! Here's your exam back. You failed. No, 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 no. This can't be. Let me do a retest. You can't do a retest because you failed every single test in high school and college. You'll have to work at McDonald's for the rest of your life. Are you serious right now? Whoa, 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 whoa. Excuse me, miss. You got my order wrong. I asked for no pickles and you just gave me pickles. Oh, I am so sorry about that. That's it, Brianna. You're fired. You've gotten every single customer's order wrong and your shirt is wrinkly. You'll have to live the rest of your life on the streets, jobless, with no money. No, no, please don't fire me. I need this job. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Oh, thank goodness I'm back. You couldn't face your fear. You failed. Game over. Okay, I failed. I accept it. Just hurry up and eliminate me. I now pronounce you husband and wife. If we're husband and wife, then we should kiss. Um, okay, I guess, Kimmy, but just on the cheek, okay? Okay, I guess. <laughs> I got money? Mommy, today at school, I got money. Oh, honey, you must have kissed someone. Every time you kiss someone, you get money. But it has to be someone new every time. If you kiss the same person, you won't get money. So that means I could be rich, but I don't want to kiss boys. That's gross. <coughs> Mom, are you feeling okay? Sweetie, it's cancer. The medical bills are going to be way too expensive, and I'm too sick to work. How am I going to pay the bills? Mom, don't worry. I'll get you enough money. Bestie, I need your help. I need to kiss as many boys as possible. Ew. It's for my mom. She needs the money. Oh, well, look over there. There's Eugene. He's a nerd. He'll kiss you for sure. Look over there. There's Eugene. He's a nerd. He'll kiss you for sure. Eugene, I need you to kiss me. I'll kiss you on one condition. You have to say Eugene is the smartest, hottest guy on the planet. I'm not saying that. You can just kiss me on the cheek if it's such a big deal. You do know you get way more money if you kiss someone on the lips, right? <laughs> Eugene is the smartest, hottest guy on the planet. Okay, now say it like you mean it. No, we had a deal. I said it. Now kiss me. Okay, don't yell at me. Yuck, why does it taste like feet? What I do in my spare time is none of your business. I got money. Now who can I kiss next? Principal Stevens, wait. 
Hey, Brianna, your best friend told me you're trying to kiss as many boys as possible to get money for your mom. I'm down if you are. But Jason, you're my boyfriend's best friend, and my boyfriend and I haven't even had our first kiss yet. Fine, if you don't want money for your mom. Fine, I'll do it. <laughs> Jason, just please don't tell my boyfriend. Don't worry, he already knows. I wonder what's in mommy's purse. Chicken nugget. Brianna, did you steal my purse? I really hope you're telling the truth, because if you don't tell the truth before the timer runs out, you'll die. Okay, I took it. I'm glad you told the truth. Now remember, never lie, because it's very dangerous, okay? Okay. Brianna, has Jake came to school yet? Uh, my boyfriend Jake? No, I haven't seen him yet. Hey, baby. Jakey! Are we still on for our date tonight? Of course. <laughs> Jake, you are so funny. Huh? It's just like, you could get any girl in the world, and you trust Brianna. <laughs> um, anyways, I gotta go. I'll see you later, babe. Okay, bye, Jakey. Hey, Emma. Do you have a crush on my boyfriend? Because you were acting like a total pick-me when he was around. What? No way. Why would I like your boyfriend? Are you sure you're telling the truth? Honestly? What? No, why would I like your boyfriend? Are you sure you're telling the truth? Honestly, yeah, I do have a crush on Jake. But there's something else you should know. Jake and I were dating behind your back a few months ago. I'm sorry, Brianna. No, no, Emma, you're lying. He would never do that. If I was lying, I would die. Go ask Jake yourself if you don't believe me. Got your pen. Jakey. <laughs> Jake, Emma told me earlier that you guys used to date while dating me. Is that true? It's Brianna and Jake. Did you already finish your assignments? Yep. Yes, sir. It's true. Emma and I were seeing each other while you and I were dating. But I don't love Emma. I've always loved you. I don't love you and I never have, Jake. Brianna. I'm in love with Jake and I always have been. Was that Jake? I have to complete 100 tasks today? There's no way I'll be able to complete them all by the end of the day. You have to try because if you don't complete them all, you die. Run to school. I have to run to school. Bye, Mom. Ew, why are you all sweaty? My first task of the day was to run to school. How many tasks did you get today? I got 10. No way, I got 100. That's a lot. I don't know how you're going to be able to complete them all. I know, they're trying to eliminate me. Enter the class late and balk like a chicken. Brianna, you're late. <laughs> what? I think I just got the ick. No, Jakey. Rip your test and say you're the muffin man. I am the Muffin Man! Brianna, disrupt my class again and you'll be going to detention. Sorry, sir. Guess what? I only got one task today. That's great. What's your task? To kill you. Give me I love stealing Big Sissy's makeup. It's so much fun. Brianna, you did something wrong. You stole your big sister's makeup. Now you must make things right. You must right your wrong before the timer runs out or else you die. Live or die, the choice is up to you. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I stole your lipstick and I put it all over my face. It was a mistake and I really hope you forgive me. <laughs> I can't believe you took my lipstick again. What's wrong with you? You're such a little brat. Wait, don't worry about it, okay? I forgive you. I love you. I love you, sissy. Mommy, when's dinner ready? I cheated, I cheated on you. I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to. What? Ah, daddy! Cover your eyes. <laughs> This is all your guys' fault. You kids are so bad you wouldn't have found another woman. Or maybe you're just a terrible wife. Don't you? Guys, stop fighting. I just got a timer over my head. So did I. Maybe you're just a terrible wife. Don't you? Guys, stop fighting. I just got a timer over my head. So did I. Mom, I'm sorry. I didn't mean what I said. I only said it because I was mad at you. Yeah, okay, whatever, fine. I'm sorry too, okay? And I forgive you. Why is the timer still going off? I made my wrong right. I said sorry. You have to mean it, Mom. Okay, okay, I mean it. Come on, stop. Sissy, don't look. This is bull. Hey, any luck finding a job? Not yet. It's really been hard for me to take care of you on my own since Mom died. If we don't find a way to get money soon, you'll have to be put in foster care. I can't take care of you anymore. I'll find a job soon, okay? Hey, have a good day at school, okay? We'll figure this out. I love you. Oh, um, sir, sir, you dropped your wallet. 
Oh, how did I not notice? Thank you so much. No problem. Brianna, you did something wrong. It's time to right your wrong or face the consequences of your actions. Brianna, you did something wrong. It's time to right your wrong or face the consequences of your actions. Sir! Sir, wait! Sir! I stole money from your wallet before giving it back to you. I knew it was wrong and I'm so sorry I did that. I just couldn't help myself. I really need the money and I wasn't thinking. Thank you. It's very brave of you to own up to your actions. You're a good person. No. I'm not a good person. If there was no consequence to my action, I wouldn't have gave the money back. You are a good person, because someone who is bad would never truly believe what they did was wrong. Here, take this. Consider it a gift. Sir, I can't accept this. I won't accept it back, so you might as well keep it. But I don't deserve it. Yes, you do. Have a good day. That voice. Wait! Where did he go? Hey, Professor, sorry I'm late. Your professor's not here. Today I'll be the one teaching the class. Brianna looks like she's seen a ghost. <laughs> now, Brittany. Brianna looks like she's seen a ghost. <laughs> now, Brittany. Making fun of someone is not a very nice thing to do. Apologize or face the consequences. The substitute teacher is the controller of right or wrong. What? Anyways, I guess I need to apologize. I'm so sorry that you're so easy to make fun of. Brittany, no, that's not an apology. Fine, I'm so sorry your face looks so silly when you're scared. No! Brittany! You're not going anywhere. You've got a lot of learning to do. Mmm, cookie. Can I see? Sure. Give me that. <gasps> Timmy, give me my cookie back. Timmy, stealing someone's food without permission is not right. Make it right or die. <gasps> okay, here. You already took a bite out of it. Hold out your hand. I can give it back. No, no, no. It's fine. It's fine. You keep it. Hello? Sissy, the control of right or wrong is in my classroom. Brianna's using her phone in class. Jimmy! Jimmy, Mr. Snowman! I got it! <laughs> catch me if you can! Ricky! <laughs> Wanna catch you, Ricky? You're not gonna come after me? It says this action would have consequences. I don't want to find out what kind of consequence. Yeah, it could have a bad consequence, like Mr. Snowman dying. <gasps> Honey, would you like a ride to school? No, I'm fine, Mom. I'll just take the bus. Wait, I made you some lunch. Here. I could have just bought lunch at school, Mom. I love you. I love you, too. Thanks for the lunch. Bree, want to come with us to throw Timmy in the fountain? Yeah. No, guys, I don't think that's a good idea. Help me! Hey, Brianna. Jake. You look amazing today. Thanks. Come closer. How about you and I skip class and go on a walk together? I would love... I would love to. Perfect. Mommy, why do I always have to wear this blindfold? The kids at school make fun of me. You were born with a curse. If you make eye contact with someone, they'll die. <gasps> you can take off your blindfold, but you must promise me you'll never make eye contact with anyone. Okay, Mommy. I promise. I'm not making eye contact! 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 Good job! <laughs> oh no! Mommy! What happened to your mother? Daddy, I made a mistake! I made eye contact with mommy! No! <laughs> Look, it's deadly eye contact, girl. No one go near her. She killed her own parents when she was six. Ah! Ah, she just tried to kill me! She tried to make eye contact with me! I wasn't trying to make eye contact with you! I was looking at the floor! You okay, baby? Yeah, just keep her away from me. You again. Don't try and make eye contact with me. I'm not. Just go ahead. Go down the stairs first. I am. Don't follow me. We're making eye contact. <coughs> <coughs> oh, no. She only has one brain cell today. That's not enough. How is she going to survive? <laughs> Here, honey. Eat this. It's breakfast. She can't go through the day with only one brain cell. I know what to do. I was gifted a special chocolate that increases brain cells. Honey, eat this right away. Kitchen. No, sweetie, that's chocolate. You need to eat it. So close, sweetie, but a bit lower. Yes. And take a bite. The mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. I just read that entire book in three seconds. Honey, she has infinite brain cells. All right, guardians, I'm off to school. No need to walk me. I know the way. Class, what's three plus two? The answer's five, miss. What is this, baby class? Are we in baby school? 
This is kindergarten, but you're too smart for kindergarten. You'll have to go to high school.